My name's Alan. Let me talk to you about this A49 keyboard I have. I've got it hidden under the desk. Just a great little keyboard. It's USB powered. It doesn't need any AC power. It's got a custom key bed by Native Instruments. Comes in 25, 49, or 61 keys. Very affordable in that it's about a third of the price of the S series keyboards. The keys are semi-weighted, have a good feel. Innovative controls, touch controls. As soon as you touch these, it knows it. The main difference between the A series and the S series, the S series has a screen that allows you a little bit more visibility. I don't need that because I just use it on the doll. Just look at the doll, look at the computer screen. Plus the little screen is so small, I can't see it anyway that well. So this keyboard really does everything I need to do. I use it for a MIDI controller. It integrates with most every doll, uh, Machine, Logic, GarageBand, Ableton Live, Cubase, uh, Pro Tools. Once you integrate with the right doll, uh, it's got play, record, stop, tempo, metro, loop, uh, shift, scale, undo, quantize. It's just a, a great little keyboard. I got the 49 so I could slide it under my desk, out of the way, because I do... Um, I do video editing also for my YouTube channel. So I want it out of the way and be able to use my uh, keyboard up here when I need to do the video editing and the mouse, of course. Out of the way when I don't need it. Out when I do. I've paired it with the M Gear pedal, which has a polarity switch on it. So that means it will work on just about any keyboard. But this has been a great keyboard for me. I didn't want to break the bank and get the S series. So I got the A. I'm happy with it. It does everything I needed to do for about a third of the price of the S.